Hi, Cappy. Welcome back to my channel, Unique Tarot. This is going to be your 4th of July pop-up love messages. All right, if you're new, hit the subscribe button and also give me a thumbs up, okay? So this is for Cappy, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus pop-up love messages. All right. For Capricorn. All right, so we have Ace of Cups, so something new. You're dealing with someone new here, Cappy. Okay, this could either be forgiveness or a renewal in a relationship, or this could be someone new. Let's see what this Ace of Cups is. Okay, Spirit so said put those back. But I'm getting a very, somebody here is very psychic or very spiritual. What's the Ace of Cups? Okay, we have the Queen of Pentacles. So this is you, Cappy. So you have a new love here, yeah. Or you're doing something new for work or there's a Gemini somewhere. Definitely a Gemini that wants to rush in. There's an ex that wants to come in or they're coming towards you. Or what's the Ace of Cups or they want your forgiveness? What's the Ace of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles? Or this is you, Cappy. Yeah, Seven of Cups. What's the Seven of Cups? All right, let's see. What is this? That's too many. Give me one. What is the Seven of Cups? I feel like you're daydreaming about new love here. Or you want new love. You have the Ten of Pentacles. Or you're wondering what to do with this money or how to invest this money. You have Nine of Pentacles. So you're very, very comfortable here. Very well off. Your business is doing very well here, Capricorn. If you work from home or whatever. Yeah, you're Nine of Pentacles. You're Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. Nothing but Pentacles around you here, Cappy. Okay, do very well, very financially well off. And I feel like you're thinking about what to do with this money, or how to invest it, or how you can become even richer, or how you can how you can keep things going for your kids. Okay, how you can create a legacy for your kids here. Yeah, we have the Knight of Swords. A Gemini is rushing in here. What is this Gemini doing? Yeah. Definitely something to do with the Gemini. But somebody's coming in. They want to express their emotions or they want to tell you how they feel. Yeah, Knight of Cups. All right. They want to ask you out or offer you something here. Somebody's really taking action towards you. Maybe they see you're doing something new here. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. All right, but I feel like somebody's coming in to propose here. Somebody wants to propose to you here, Capricorn. Yeah, we have the Empress. Wow, beautiful. Okay, yeah, this is somebody that you moved on from that was taken forever to make an offer. I feel like somebody's made a decision here now. They're ready. They're coming towards you, Cappy. Yeah, and I feel like you're just like, whatever, because you're spoiled. You're comfortable. Your money is good. You're living life. I mean, you're the Empress is here. Okay, so also someone, this could be where there's someone that's married because we have two queens here and the empress. We have the nine of pentacles and the empress here. So somebody's very well off, very comfortable. Maybe somebody couldn't decide between what they wanted in the past, but I feel like now they're choosing you, Cappy, or you're really putting, um, you're really, really, pampering yourself here as well nails hair skin working out taking care of yourself loving yourself focused on your money and new beginnings maybe a new job and just really looking towards the future here really really taking taking the necessary steps to make yourself happy here and that's beautiful you're just going to worry about you if this is simply getting your nails done or whatever, yeah, 10 of cups, you're going to be happy. And we got the five of cups and there's somebody here that is that is wanting to come in because you're moving forward to something new. All right. Yeah. Six of wands sitting up on your throne. OK. Yeah. There's somebody at a distance that wants to come in and I feel like you're very much closed off to them. Yeah, there's somebody losing sleep and shit because they see you're doing something else. You're moving on. You're not worried about them. They daddy, they mama, they auntie, or none of them hoes. You focused on yourself, on, on your success, and, and abundance is around you. A lot of it. Very comfortable. A lot of you are getting proposed to, married, starting a family, and some more shit. Yeah, there's somebody that's stuck on you. Somebody you left behind. 
All right, yeah, star card. Yeah, somebody's definitely in the public eye. Yeah, two of cups. All right, somebody's highly influential on any given platform. Temperance in the page of wands. I feel like somebody's, yeah, the world. Something that you thought was over. Somebody's rushing in. They want to restart a cycle with you. They want they want to start a family. Also, if this is someone new, you're going to have a family with this person. You're going to have kids, okay? This is the twin flame, very spiritual connection here. You're going to purchase a new home. I mean, you're really going to start a life with this person. I feel like this is the person you're meant to be with. This person that you've met that is new that could be in the public eye or whatever. Yeah, somebody is a, a world-renowned star with a star card and six of wands here. Somebody's going to be a spiritual guru and world-renowned, known all over for their gifts. Yeah, somebody ended something. Death and the Eight of Cups walked away from a situation here, and now somebody's doing great. And there's somebody over here from the past. What's the Five of Cups, Nine of Swords? Yeah, Ten of Swords that it ended with. But somebody's stuck on how it ended or why it ended or they can't believe you left or, yeah, Five of Pentacles wanted to come out. Yeah, this person feels out in the cold. Yeah, they're stuck. Eight of Swords. Yep, Seven of Pentacles. Thinking about this connection and how it was or how they broke your heart or how they played my games or how they put you in a third party or how they betrayed you or how they put you in competitive situations when really the whole time you were the star. Okay, you were the one. The sun, the star, the six of wands, very abundant, very comfortable, very beautiful, elegant, like the shit. So, hey, it is what it is. Those are your messages, Cappy. I hope that resonated. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share this video with anyone and everyone. Happy 4th of July, and I'll see y'all in the next one.